Hey YouTube, it's Michael Lambert here. I'm back once again with another reaction video. Once again, I'm reacting to Corrupt Al 125 in this video. These Lay's chips are a fan favorite. Lay's deep dish pizza potato chips review. Sam's Club. This is the new one that he uploaded today and I'm going to react to it right now. And if any notifications pop up during the video, I apologize and I will take care of them. Now let's get to this video. Today we're going to try Lay's deep dish pizza potato chips. Apparently a fan favorite. Um, didn't know that. And they're only at Sam's Club. So these are apparently a returning flavor. I don't think I've ever had them. As far as I remember, I have terrible memory. Um, and now they're released only at Sam's Club for some reason. Um, some, sometimes Sam's Club just gets exclusive things. I don't know why. Um, I guess to entice people to get a Sam's Club membership, uh, which, you know, whatever. If you have one near you, you know, it's fine. Um, you, you know, work it out for yourself. But $4.48 um, for this bag at Sam's Club. Try and keep the price in mind. Let everybody know. $4.48. But this is a big bag. It's 15, almost 16 ounces, 15 and 3 fourths ounces. Uh, which is a big bag because most like standard pot uh, potato chip and like Dorito bags now are around nine to ten ounces. So you're definitely getting a lot here for 4.48. So I don't think the price is out of line or anything. I think 4.48 is actually a pretty decent price for such a big bag of chips, assuming they're good um, at Sam's Club, especially at Sam's Club because it's very rare you get things like this that aren't you know a ten pack or whatever. So got a big bag of chips here. Hopefully they stay fresh. Um, after I open them, but we're gonna try it out. Deep dish pizza, obviously one of the best flavors you can ever get. I don't have a good deep dish place near me. It makes me sad. Um, I would love to have a good deep dish place near me to try, but I am very curious to see how these are going to be any different from like a pizza, a standard pizza potato chip, which generally, I, as a kid, I liked pizza chips, like pizza Pringles and stuff like that, but I generally don't like them as much now. They kind of all have a very weird um, kind of cheap tomato sauce flavor to them, and I'm hoping that this is not that, because if that's if this is just that, that's a huge disappointment, because they all have that kind of similar cheap tomato sauce cheese flavor, and I would hope with Deep Dish we're getting something a little richer, so let's open up the bag what we're working with. I don't know. First sign is maybe a little disappointment. They smell like normal pizza potato chips. They look like that. But we'll only know after we give it a taste. So let's get a couple out of here. I mean, I won't be mad if they taste like that, but I'll definitely be disappointed. So here we go. Very impressive effort from Lace here. Um, I was I was ready to be disappointed. I was assuming I would be disappointed, but I got to say I'm very I'm very impressed with the way these turned out. They are not like the traditional pizza chips that I'm used to. Thankfully, um, they don't have that cheap tomatoey taste. In fact, they have a very good tomatoey taste, um, a very delicious tomatoey taste, which I'll get into in a second. Um, but more importantly, they do have uh, the taste of deep dish, which is kind of shocking to me. I was not ready for this. So when you bite into the chip, the first taste I got, which I was not expecting because they smelled just like that kind of cheap tomatoey flavor would smell. But the first thing I got was kind of almost uh, like a yeasty kind of sourdoughy bread flavor, um, like a nice uh, crust on a deep dish pizza. That's the first thing that hit me, which was very surprising considering the color and the consistency and the smell. And then right after that, tomato. And I'm talking really good tomato. This has a very, very nice um, kind of savory tomato, like like seasoned tomato, like Italian seasoned tomato with some with some nice seasonings on it. It tastes like a, like a really rich tomato sauce. And, and for some reason, and I know this might not make sense, um, as you can see, the tomato sauce on here is kind of chunky. That's that's what it tastes like. I don't know if that's really a taste or if I'm just, you know, if I'm making sense. But it tasted like a chunky tomato sauce, like a really nice chunky tomato sauce. Then the bread flavor came back in um, and then the cheese. It's all there. It's all present. Um, th there's no pepperoni taste or anything. It's just cheese and tomato and um, the crust flavor. But it all is, it's all present and it all comes and it all works together and it does in the end, tastes like a pretty good quality deep dish pizza. It's, it's very impressive what they've managed to pull out here. 
Um, I can understand why they were voted a fan favorite, although I don't know where or when this vote took place or any of that. I don't know any of the details, but I know that this is a really great Lay's flavor. Um, I, I think, like I, like I said in the beginning, I usually associate pizza kind of chips with cheapness. And these are a cheap bag. I mean, it's four forty-eight. Like I said, it's not like an expensive price. It's pretty much in line considering it's a giant bag of chips. Um, I was not expecting them to be as good as they are. So I, I understand why these are a fan favorite. I understand why um, Sam's Club wanted to lock them up because I do think it's worth going. I mean, obviously, you shouldn't buy a Sam's Club membership if you don't want it. But if you have a Sam's Club membership or you're thinking about it, um, I honestly think these pizza chips are worth going out of your way for and checking out. Um, if you're a chip person, if you eat a lot of chips, if this idea sounds appealing to you because it works. And it tastes just like what it says, and it's very, 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 very high quality compared to, considering it's Lay's, basically. I was not expecting the taste there. These are great chips. I'm going to keep you. Sorry about that, everybody. I was trying to crack my neck. Sorry about that. And let me take care of this notification. Hold on. Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that. Them. I'm going to keep buying them um, for as long as they're there. Assumingly, they won't be a Sam's Club, you know, uh, exclusive forever. Usually the Sam's Club exclusives eventually come out to Walmart and other stores, but for now you can check it out at Sam's Club again. Four forty-eight for a bag. Decent, decent deal. Uh, I have no complaints about the price. I think it's a good deal um, for a good bag of chips. So Lay's Deep Dish Pizza, I'm going to give them a five. Um, I love these. These are some of my favorite chips recently, and I will continue to buy them. And oh, oh yeah, uh, <laughs> On my note here, which you might not have seen, I have prices for things on my note here. So I remember the prices of items, 448. I have it right here taped up so I can remember. Um, I'm going to start doing this at the end of videos. I asked people in my McDonald's mukbang video a couple weeks ago whether I should. So I'm going to start implementing it. It just feels a little weird. It's a little awkward for me to do, but... Um, here at the end, um, I'm just going to throw out, hey, if you like the video, please like it. And if you want to comment, comment and subscribe if you haven't, if you want to. Um, don't, don't do any of those things if you don't want to. I don't want to feel like I'm compelling people into these things. But, you know, if this review was helpful to you or you like it, you know, just go ahead and like and comment. And if you want to sub, uh, go ahead and sub. And with that, I will see you all next time. Awesome video. I give it a thumbs up. And I hope you all enjoyed this reaction video. If you're all new to my main channel or my second channel or Corrupt Al 125's channel, make sure you guys subscribe. Give both our videos a thumbs up. Hit the notification bell to let you guys know when we both post and share both of our videos with your friends and family members too, please, everybody. And on my main channel, we are on the road to 7,000 subscribers. And on my second channel, we are on the road to 2,000 subscribers. And please don't forget to take a look at my other videos on my channel's playlists. On both my main channel and my second channel, give them a thumbs up and share them with your friends and family members too, please, everybody. I would really appreciate it. And please help me accomplish my goal to get 7,000 subscribers or more on my main channel and 2,000 subscribers or more on my second channel too, please, everybody. I would really appreciate that too. And please help me bring my views and watch hours up on my main channel by taking a look at my other videos that are on the two playlists that are on my main channel, give them a thumbs up and share them with your friends and family members too, please everybody, I would really appreciate that. And please help me bring my subscriber count up on my main channel as well also, please everybody, I would really appreciate that too. Please everybody, please, please everybody, please. And I'm off now, so until next time, see ya.